Will it be a summer of love for the Heckam? What the data is telling us. Welcome back to the Industry Leader Update. Last Thursday, we released the Top 100 Retail Heckam Lenders Report for endorsements in the month of May, and that led me to ask the question, will reverse mortgage lenders and originators feel the love of increasing Heckam endorsements this summer? Will it be a summer of love? Well, to answer that question, we're going to go to the one place which supersedes pessimism and unbridled optimism, and that is FHA case number assignments. Each and every month, FHA releases its FHA Single Family Production Report, which, by the way, we've included a link to in the video description and just below this video if you're watching on Heckam World. That report gives us a wealth of data on both the traditional FHA-insured mortgage, but most notably the home equity conversion mortgage itself. And in its characteristics data, we can see that FHA is continuing to fulfill their mission to assist first-time home buyers and also the type of properties that are associated with traditional FHA-insured mortgages, which are endorsed by the agency. However, the more germane data, which is related to Heckam loan application activity, it reveals the demographic breakdown of Heckam endorsements. And it does so by the loan's purpose, the product type, the gender of the borrower, the borrower age brackets, principal limits, and the maximum claim amounts. However, if we're going to determine if the summer months are actually going to provide some sunshine of increasing Heckam endorsements, we're going to have to go to the last page of that report. And that is the Heckam Application Activity Report. It reveals the monthly totals of Heckam applications received, what we call case number assignments. Now, that data really speaks for itself because it reveals the ebb and flow of Heckam to Heckam refinances that we saw in the boom of 2021 and early 22, also the overall application volume. Now, the data is in, so let's look at a comparison of Heckam case number assignments by month and assume a four-month lag before endorsement. Now, first of all, we have to address the wild swings that we see in pull-through rates, that is, the applications that resulted in a funded and endorsed Heckam loan. Now, some of that may be explained by rapidly increasing interest rates and also softening home values. But then there's March, a number that defied explanation until we considered that AAG most likely had a number of loans to get endorsed through their pipeline prior to its acquisition by Finance of America. Now, that resulted in the surge of endorsements or 114% pull-through rate from November. Now, knowing that the average time from Heckam application to case number assignment, again, is approximately four months to endorsement, let's see what the first months of the summer may actually bring us. And again, we're going to the data. Assuming a stable 64% pull-through rate, February and March case number assignments could push Heckam endorsements to nearly 2,300 units in June and 2,600 in July. That's good news considering the sharp peak to trial that we saw late last summer as refinance transactions saw significant curtailment. And when comparing leading applications to eventual fundings and insured loans or endorsements, the trend line becomes clear. So will we have a summer of love for Heckam Lending? If we do, it will be a modest embrace of increasing endorsements. But the real work lies ahead, as it always does, in application activity, and that hinges on attracting new first-time Heckin borrowers. Now, what insights would you add to the data that we just reviewed today? Join the conversation in the comments section below. And also, if you'd be so kind as to share this video with other mortgage pros on your LinkedIn and Facebook profiles. Don't forget, we have a YouTube channel where you can subscribe and hit the like button if you appreciate today's episode. And don't forget, you can catch up on your reverse mortgage news. No subscription, no paywalls. You can just do that by plugging in your headphones and listening to Heckam World Weekly the nation's only weekly podcast for reverse mortgage pros. And by the way, if you're an Apple user, you can listen and subscribe on iTunes. That's a wrap for us this week, and be sure to return next Monday for more reverse mortgage news, commentary, and analysis here at Hackam World.